Pike on. Uh, today I'm fishing down on the uh, Bristol Avon in Saltford. Just spent the last 15 minutes trying to whack down a load of scrub to uh, find a spot to fish in. I'll show you where I'm fishing. That's what it originally looked like. Basically it's quite shallow just upstream and I'm just going to use up some bait that I've um, got left over from the week's coaching. Really manky. Load of casters that 90% of those are going to float. Some ground bait mixed in with uh, some micro pellet. And I think the pinkies are turning as well. Yep, they're all turned. The main purpose really is to cut the swim out and perhaps start pre-baiting it as a spot. It gets fished a hell of a lot by, you know, pleasure anglers, um, right where you can park the car in the Saltford shallows. But people just don't want to walk anywhere, do they? I'm going to use a 15 foot waggler rod, four pound main line. I have a choice of four floats. Five number four, again, Y stem, and a 2AA insert waggler, or a Drennan 6BB stick. Now, all of these floats, apart from that one, are for faster moving water, so that's probably the best out of the bad bunch. Looks like I'm going to fish just off bottom. <laughs> Can't fish 17 foot. Number eight's near the hook link. Number six is gradually longer distances between each shot up to the float. And they're spread out and I'll be laying, laying the float down in case there's fish feeding on the drop. So I've been looking forward to um, coming back out from the river since it's opened up again. But it's just, just been too hot. <laughs> No, just stand up paddle waters as well. That's another reason why I didn't fish it in the summer. One roach. Charlie. Kingfisher. Putting that ground bait in. And they're gradually getting slightly bigger. whether the bream will come up off the bottom to set baits because can't get depth this float rod because of these old manky casters a lot of them are floating and it's um, causing quite a lot of attention on the surface from fish which I'm assuming a chub you now shallowed up to about three foot got anything? yeah there's plenty of roach I can see them all wrong, isn't it? yeah I'm using up some old baits I teach kids to fish and that's all left over from the week yeah, I did try and do it more locally, but my face didn't fit. <laughs> so oh. I had to go further afield. But well, I have to say, years ago, I did try fishing up at Hunter Street Lake, and they had so many rules up there, um, I didn't really like it. Yeah, they, they, got, they, they invited me onto their committee, and it turned out the only reason why they wanted me to join the committee was so that they could use my coaching to get a planning permission put through for their supposed... Um, teaching hut that they wanted to build on on the lakes. Really? They see one of their own little yeah. oh, that oh, There we go. There we go, yeah, little so chub. <laughs> Hopefully they'll get bigger. Oh, dear, Fishing became very much about all carp and boilies and all that. It has, that's not the kind of fishing I like. It's going it is going back to what you probably used to enjoy. Well good luck. Cheers. Maybe I'll see luck. you again back Yeah I hope so.
far back, but was actually a species a bit more bent than the And again, obviously just like that tree cover. Catch those ah, all evening. Nice fish. Right, so my last for my last trick, I'm just gonna fish as deep as I possibly can on my float rod. I reckon I might be able to reach the bottom just in front of me where I've been feeding this afternoon. And I'm gonna hold the float back and see if there's anything bigger or better down there feeding on the on the ground bait that I've been putting in. Right, it's got cold. As it is the first of October, I think, second of October. I've just caught that, which I think. Hard in the maggots because it's time to go. And I've got a nice bream. Silver bream or common bream? Difficult to tell. I'm not very good at telling the difference in silver bream, common bream. I'm saying common bream because its eye doesn't look big enough to be a silver. Very pleasing though. 